Welcome to Schulte Sweetie's YouTube channel. My name is Stephanie and I'm a mom of three girls ages 11, 7, and 5. This is our sixth year homeschooling and today I wanted to share with you a math program that we have started using with my oldest. So, so um, if you've seen some of my updates, like we, my oldest was using the Good and the Beautiful level five. So she's in sixth grade, but she was using level five. And um, I was already planning on switching her to another math program um, next year. So I was already planning on things. And then she, <laughs> when I told her that, she said, actually, I would really like to switch now. Um, and I, I did not know that she was that frustrated with her math, but it was taking her a good, like, hour and a half to complete it. She was in tears a lot of days. It was very frustrating for her and she was like not enjoying it, even with the beautiful um, pictures and things. But like, it was just a lot of work. And um, even when I tried to cut down things, like you can't cut down the whole curriculum and you just never know what you are gonna need to get. Um, and so we just decided to switch. So I gave her some different options that I had already been researching and um, she went with one that I was kind of surprised with. Um, we were able to get this purchased through our charter for a discounted price. And um, since it, it was like only $35 for us to start this program, it's 35 for seven months for us. Um, I think there are different options, so I will share that in a minute. But um, we decided since that wasn't very much um, through the charter that we would go ahead and try this out and um the the way that she has responded with it i am so happy that we switched because um she now really likes math um and enjoys it like she was so like after the test the initial test um with when she was placed, our charter placed her in six, the sixth grade level. I was a little nervous since she had been in level five for the good and the beautiful. And I wasn't sure how the testing was going to go. Um, but she did the initial test and even if like she got some wrong, but she got a lot right. And I think she, that boosted her confidence just even in that first little bit of, um, doing the initial test. Um, and since if she would have placed, um, under 15%, and or under and according to our charter she would be um in the next level down if she placed 85 percent or above she'd be in the next level above so um we went ahead and just uh did the test and she got it like i think it was 65 69 i will show that in a little bit um but she just went ahead and placed there and like it was so cool because there is a pie chart which i will show you um and you can see the different areas that she needs to work on and how much she needs to work on it um the com the lessons are kind of like micro lessons is what i would kind of say i don't feel like it teaches a topic to a whole when you just do like a little lesson but i assign those like several of them a day and she just gets right on that and does them and it's not like drill and kill but she's still learning and she's understanding it so um, i'm gonna just do a computer screen of what alex math is like for her so this is the front page of the alex math um, you have your pie chart and then you go through the there's whole numbers decimals fractions Ratio and proportions and measurement, percents, integers and rational numbers, equations and inequalities, graphs and functions, line angles and polygons, transformations, perimeter, area and volume, and data analysis and probability. This is, these are all the topics that are going to be covered, some more than others. This would be a lesson. Um, it's just a very short lesson to kind of introduce the topic. Off to the right, there are some help buttons there sometimes is a calculator available this is where the videos are available i will admit they are not very entertaining um, so i will let you watch this video hello this is mrs hyman estimate 17 and 5 tenths times 4 and 3 tenths well to estimate these we're going to round these to the nearest whole number first so we're going to take 17 and five tenths, and rounding that 
to the nearest whole number, that would make it 18 because the 5 here is going to make us round up. And then we'll take 4 and 3 tenths. And if we round that to the nearest whole number, that would round to 4. So now we're going to multiply our two new numbers here, 18 times 4. So 4 times 8 is 32. And we have 3 tens over here to carry. And 4 times 1 is 4, plus 3 is 7. So an estimate of 17 and 5 tenths times 4 and 3 tenths would be about 72. So not a very great video, um, but there are some extra helps. There's the dictionary if they need help with the terms being used. And then um, this is up at the top, there is an arrow where they can change their lessons. It gives all the topics that are available. It will just have diff different ones available and it doesn't really matter what order they go in. And usually I just have my daughter pick a couple at a time each day to do. Then off to the left, there's gonna be more of a menu, um, different things that you can use for help. Um, there's like, you can assign things, we don't use that. You can create worksheets. We don't do that either usually. And then um, there's also a calendar available. We do use this for reports. Like if you needed to turn in a report, you could re use this. Um, I like to be able to check this out to see what she has worked on and what topics maybe aren't learned. And if I need to go and talk to her about that, um, I can do that. Um, and then I can also see what topics, like if she's completed a pie chart, There's, I think she's completed three of them. But these are the little subtopics you can look at, which ones she has done, um, and which ones she has learned, and then which ones she has mastered. So this is kind of like a spiral approach, um, but also a mastery. Like they do also do progress checks again, um, like extra testing as well. So I do appreciate that with the extra testing. There's quick tables, there's a dictionary, um, there's a message center on here. We haven't had to contact the customer service yet, thankfully. Um, and then you're able to also manage your class, which we don't need, but um, this is available for public school as well. So this is just showing you all the extras that they have available. Dictionary. And then this is her pie chart again, and I can see a timeline of what she has worked on throughout the week as well. So as I'm looking at the website, like I said, we got um, it at a discount. We got Alex Math at a discount for um, $35 through our charter. So definitely if you are in a charter or have a charter in your state, check it out and see if you can get it discounted. Sometimes they offer that for different programs. So. Um, as I'm looking at the prices, it says we offer a family discount for six to, they have a six month term or a 12 month term. Um, and so it looks like, um, actually this seems like a program that's actually on the cheaper side for math as you get into upper grades. Because have you noticed, I don't know, I've been doing a lot of research of figuring out math programs and they are kind of expensive. So um, if you have one student for a six month term, which is possible probably to complete a level, um, we are doing seven months. So um, I'm not sure why that's an option for us, but that, <laughs> that is. Um, but if you were doing a six month term, you could do for one student $99.95. And then um, I guess total discount off a monthly rate is 16.5%. Um, and then if you have two students for a six month term, you could, it's $169.90. So um, if that, that's for the six month term and then for a 12 month term, so a full year in the program, 
um, for one student is $179.95. But if you have two students using that, like in the upper, actually, this is for um, K through 12 as the, as well. Um, so that is available. It's not just for upper grades. Um, so if you have two students, you, it would be a $305.90. And then the discount keeps going. Um, so if you have mo like up to six, it says up to six students, but I mean, you probably could continue to get discounts. I'm not sure um, if you had more. Um, so it is available K through 12. When I was looking at other programs for my younger girls, I almost considered doing this at least for my middle daughter, but um, I think I'm going to actually wait a little bit longer for her to do it as well. Um, so definitely check out Alex Math, A-L-E-K-S. It's um, actually from McGraw Hill um, and it's a website and it has, you can use this in public schools or you could use this at home. So I hope that this is helpful to you.